past champion Minji Li got off to a strong start at the Blue Bay LGA event in China, after posting a smooth 7 under 65, which TIs the course record. The Aussie holds a one-stroke advantage over American Sarah Schmelzel and Chinese players Miranda Wang and Ruixin Liu. This marks the first edition of the Blue Bay event since 2018. I just took advantage of the really calm conditions this morning, said Lee. And I think with the a little bit the rain it actually stopped it even more, the wind. While Lee won twice in 2023, this marks the first time she has led or co-led after the first round since the 2020 to Chevron Championship. Earlier this season, it was announced that Lee had joined her brother Min Wu on the Callaway staff. Previously a Shrixen player, one of the best ball strikers on the LGA had some work to do to get things in order. This is her second start this season. She opened with a T29 last week in Singapore. I actually touched on everything this offseason, said Lee, especially changing my equipment to Callaway. Everything has been a little bit of a process getting used to. But I think it's going to take me a couple events just to knock the rust off and break those clubs in. Lee also holds the 36-hole and 72-hole scoring records at Blue Bay. Schmelzel led after the first round of last week's SheBC Women's World Championship and ultimately tied for eighth. Lydia Ko, who needs one more point to enter the LGA Hall of Fame and a win, would get her there, opened with a 68 at Gian Lake Blue Bay Golf Course. There are some greens with some pin positions that like is actually really hard to stay on the same tier, said Ko. I think how the rules officials are going to set up the golf course and where they put the pins are going to dictate the scores a lot. World number one Lilia Vu withdrew from the final round in Singapore on Sunday with an illness. She rested on Monday and shot 72 in the opening round. I feel like there was a big crowd out here, said Vu. I was playing with Ruining Yin, so obviously it's her crowd. There was a lot of little kids out there following her, so it was really cool to see the turnout here.